Hello everybody! Today we're going to unbox and take a close up look at the Le Creuset Stoneware Butter Dish. So let's go ahead and open up the box. And we do so very carefully with a pen knife to cut apart the brown packing tape that's keeping the box securely sealed. And open up the box flaps and lift up the protective card packaging inside and let's pop out the butter dish from its cardboard packaging and set it on the tabletop and check it through to make sure nothing else is left in the box packaging can now put the butter dish together, lid and the base or dish itself together and giving you a full and clear look at the butter dish before I start handling it. Okay, so there with a full and clear look at the butter dish now. Just resting the Le Creuset stoneware butter dish in my hand or in my palm to give you some sense of its size. And perhaps placing my hand over it as well, just to give you an idea of the size of this butter dish and giving you some perspective as well. Okay, so just setting the stoneware butter dish back down and let's focus on the lid itself. So just giving you a look with the butter dish separated lid and dish base. So I'm going to set the base to the side for now as we focus in on the lid of the butter dish. So giving you a closer in look at the details and the sticky label that's on the butter dish. So the butter dish is thermal resistant being fridge, freezer and grill safe and it is also microwave and dishwasher safe as well. And as you can see this one is in blue and it does have a glossy glaze to it. So the glaze providing the butter dish with scratch resistance. And taking a look top down, you can see the concentric rings, which is a trademark of Le Creuset's designs. And taking a look at the underside of the butter dish lid. So you can see it has a beige color on the majority on the side of the butter dish and it is also glazed as well. And to give you some sense of the sturdiness and thickness of the lid of this stoneware butter dish, just tapping on the various parts of the butter dish with my finger. And once again giving you a closer in look at its details and 
of course with that very sturdy carry handle as well or lifting handle okay so we're just going to set the lid to the side setting it on the right hand side of the table and moving right along back to the base of the butter dish so giving you a look at the base and the bottom of the base does have the Le Creuset branding on the underside and it is unglazed on the resting surface or contact surface of the base as you can see giving you a much closer in look as well so a very fine textured base or bottom but the rest of it as you can see has that scratch resistant glossy glaze to the blue parts as well as the inner surface in beige you can see just how reflective and glossy that finish is so let's try and achieve focus so you have a better look at the details up close as well and of course right there for that close-up detail at the rounded edges of the dish okay and once again giving you some sense of the size resting my hand over it and now let's put the Le Creuset stoneware butter dish together lid on base right there And you can hear there is a little bit of wobbling, but now let's try and turn the lid around and see if that helps. Still a little bit of play, but there we go. It's a matter of setting it in the right position, but nonetheless, it is meant to be rested anyway. Here, just how sturdy the stoneware top and bottom of this butter dish is and once again giving you a look at its overall details and carefully doing that 360 rotation So that's the Le Creuset Stoneware Butter Dish. Thanks for watching and happy storing.